is now Saturday and I'm about to head out to Zach's, but first I'm hungry, so I don't have a shirt. So I have to go through the drive through at Kane's and I'm about to show you guys just how much of a pain in the ass this smoke is. So right now the engine stopped, let me go ahead and start it up. And roll forward, as you guys can see. And then there's the smoke. Start it back up. Oh wow, the truck didn't even freaking move, what the hell? I'm gonna kill both my battery and my starter motor, but, oh well. There's two older ladies behind me and they're just like, oh yeah. We go every day. Okay, here we go. What's up? Yep. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. So we're actually gonna take the motor out of the C10 instead of taking it out of the dually. So this is like already ready to go and um, it has everything removed from it and we're at the point where it's time to pull it. So. Yeah, and pretty much, I came to my senses last night. But if we pull that engine, that engine is gonna end up looking like this anyways because I'm putting brand new parts, pretty much every single thing. This one's already new. bare and it's ready to go. Yeah. So. so, yep, here we go. And it has a brand new starter on it too. Right? It's a brand new starter on it too. Uh, hopefully it is. I remember we crossed it. Put it on backwards. I think it's stuck on the control arm. to hold this button down because the battery's completely dead. And my wife contributes to a company for And turn it off and unplug it. Alright. So we're actually gonna hook the uh, engine lift up to the uh, F-150. It has a really bad rod knock, has hella rod knock. What are you trying to do? Unhook it. Huh? Unhook it. Unhook it? Okay. Into it. Oh shit. Oh god. Oh god. Oh 
Oh god, Zach, Zach. Zach, why'd you do that? Um, technically, you were supposed to hold the engine back. I was not told this. I, I told you, grab the engine, pull him up Zach, on back. I'm an 18 year old that weighs 120 pounds. <laughs> I'm not putting that in the video. Oh shit. Dude, it like scraped the entire side of the truck. Yes. Before we get blown up with hate comments, guys, this truck is not road legal. Uh, it's not street legal. It will not pass inspection and it just sits on this property. So it's literally like a farm truck. So before you get butt hurt, this truck is worth like not much at all. So. It literally just sits. Put down that side. Push it on the tire. Okay. Now what? I'm cold. All right guys, so it took us about half an hour, but we finally moved 10 feet across this really crappy gravel. We got the lift right here. It's just, we're maxed it out right now. It's completely maxed out. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna ratchet strap the motor at an angle. So hopefully we can push it in. Ratchet strap it in. Yeah, that's what's up. Uh, it looks like it'll It's working. All right. Be careful. Oh, okay. <laughs> Be careful. Hold on. It's in. <laughs> it's in. Um. Yeah. Okay. Let's see if we. I don't see any damage to the top of the car. Yeah. Guys, do not do what we're doing at home. Don't try this at home. Do it in like a proper shot.
the ignition box. Well, the distributor cab is supposed to be right here. Yeah. So the bigger engine. Well, guys, the engine is in. It's bolted in. How many hours did that take us? Yeah. Well, the issue was pushing that yeah. uh, lift across all that gravel. Yeah. Part two coming soon. Not sure when, but soon. Stay tuned for that, guys. All right, guys, so really all we need right now is get the motor running, get a radiator, get the transmission in, make a drive shaft, and then, theoretically, this thing will be ready to go down the road, right? Theoretically. Theoretically, so. Um, but I'm gonna buy all yeah. brand new parts before we do that. Thank you guys and for watching. And honestly, we're most likely gonna pull the engine out again. Really? Yeah. Okay. I'm yeah. gonna pull it out, I'm gonna buy a, a engine stand, and, uh, Set it on there, put all the brand new parts on it. I'm basically buying every single part there is for the 350 besides the pistons and all that inside of it. Everything on the outside, all gonna be all fucking brand spanking new. Hey, there's an actual seat time. We're gonna get this car done step by step, video by video. It's gonna get done. So, like, comment, subscribe. We'll see y'all next time. I was trying to get his fucking attention, but like, hey, Come over here, can you throw some suggestions since you fucking have a nice C10? You're not good at ending videos. Ta-da! <laughs>